and what is going on guys red loaders dragon here today i got some dark souls 2 for you guys dark souls 2 pvp on the dragon remnants covenant i'm doing my uh 30 dragon scales because it's a lot of fun to pvp here on the iron keep on the bridge and people do come here for pvp so it's a good start this is on my uh, Dex Hex OP build, Dark Magic OP, yeah, I know, but it's a lot of fun, <laughs> just like that guy <laughs> experienced a thousand damage that you can just shoot in their face. Uh, is it OP, is it scumbaggy? Uh, I I think the majority think it is ridiculous, I think it's ridiculous, but it's, uh, dude, it's a lot of fun. I play games to have fun, I play Dark Souls to have fun, this is Dark Souls after all, you can do whatever you want. And uh, that's what's so good about this game. That's a bit BM there, mister. That's a bit BM. It won't even let me buff. And then he gets in a lag stab, even though I rolled. Oh, no. Missed that, mister. Look at the damage. It's just too good. It's too good. GG. Did, didn't let me buff. I wouldn't let me buff either if I summoned myself and I was fucking saw Chaos Blade, Dark Magic. But there's no way to tell, really. <laughs> Jumping off the cliff here. Um. All right, so this is number three. He's a mage. He's got this is the Hander and the Havel's shield. Is that Havel? Is that full Havel with the dark mask? Full Havel monster. It's. Is it? I can't tell. It might be dark ray. Oh, let's see here. Can I break his shield? The entire time there, I was trying to actually guard break him, but I don't know. It's oh the stun lock, the fucking infinite on that swayhander. Eat some dark magic. There you go. He didn't roll. Basically, what the dark magic does there, the great soul resonant. I I don't expect to kill anyone with it. I expect people to roll it. it it's so easy just to roll through, and uh, yes, it's kind of quick, but I think it's uh, more dangerous when you have a slow cast speed and people don't know what it is. That that's that's what I see people get. Get kills with the, the resonant weapon. All right, so we got another person that summoned me here. Uh, he's got the Grim Warrior set up with a, a katana and a fucking longsword, I think. So I'm just trying to feel him out. Baiting the parry. Paying for it. <laughs> Get a roll attack in there. Get another attack in. Look at the damage. That was three hits and that was 1500 health. If you're wondering, uh, GG sir. He tried to heal on me. That's a bit dirty though. I don't think you should heal in duels. Uh, well, whatever. It's it's your game. If it, if you get invaded, but I think when, when you summon people to your world and you heal, uh, I don't know. I don't think you should do that, but whatever. It doesn't matter. It's uh, it's your human effigy that you're risking, so you can do whatever you want. Oh, that's BM, Mr. Nivlus. I remember you. I fought you before. This is my uh, first PvP character. It's a Dex Hex build. I'm using a uh, Chaos Blade uh, inf infused with Dark Magic or Dark dark Stone. Oh, the fucking lag stab on that sneaky fuck. Ugh. Let me see here. Alright. Getting a nice good 2 to 3 4 hits there. Ooh, the phantom range on your katana, sir. See, the entire time there, I was hoping I could break his shield. Actually, I was trying to do the guard break, but then I ended up just spamming the right trigger. Oh, 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 can you see my moves? Alright, well played. Try to get the parry. Oh, jump attack, no. Oh, look at the phantom range. I rolled clearly out of that. Oh, well. But yeah, the build is Dex Hex, so 30 int, 30 faith, that's 60 points in investment right there. 50 rigor. This is a 150 PP build. So I got 50 rigor, so you got 2000 H, HP. Because right now, I think uh, base stats for your weapon, as in 12 strength and 25 dex. And 50 rigor is the way to go, because everything has such high base damage and scaling is garbage. Alright, so we got another one here, Nick Dagger, GG by the way, uh, Savlon or whatever. It was a good fight, man. It was a long fight. Bound back. He, at least this guy's letting me buff, which is nice. There's a lot of people that don't let you do that. He's got a 
At the time, I thought this was... Ooh, long short spam. Let's see if I can get the parry on this guy. Yes! Got the KD parry! Ugh! Didn't expect that to happen, did you? Bye-bye! Bye-bye! And, um... Uh... I don't even know what I was talking about anymore. But yeah, this this game is a lot of fun. Uh, you can be a complete scumbag, or you can do honor duels. It's completely up to you. Uh, I'm doing a 150p, uh, 150 build, which is kind of what the PvP community have uh, decided to, you know, let, maximum soul level, I guess. Uh, a lot of people believe 120, 135. Oh, he just got dark magic to the face. Oh man, it's so much fun. It's it's very scummy, but it's so much fun. This build is just the damage is just too good. <laughs> it's too good. All right, so we got another one here. He's, at least this guy's letting me buff. Um, I prefer pairing people. Oh, that is so sneaky. The dark fog with the bat staff. You gotta die, motherfucker. I'm sorry. You have to die. Instant poison, no thank you. Oh, you need to roll that. Missed on the running. Get the roll attack in. Oh, he rolls out. And, no, oh, misses. Oh, he can't block that. Well, you can't block it, but I wouldn't have recommended it. You need to roll that. The instant dark fog, bat staff poison is, uh... <laughs> it's so troll. It's, uh, it's really, it's really dangerous, actually. If you see someone with a bat staff, you need to kill him. 11 MC bows. Uh, I'm using the time to buff. And then I'm gonna lock on and bow back. Oh, no. Oh, I thought he was uh, gonna roll attack me there, but. He's got the. Uh, is that the Defender Sword with Lightning Infusion? I think so. And the King's Shield. Watcher set. GG. So I'm using the uh, DLC shield. I don't. I actually don't remember the name of it, but it has a lot of dark defense. If you infuse it with dark uh, thingy, you can get 100% dark defense. The scumbag just fucking keeps uh, spamming shit at me. Won't even let me buff. So I'm running away. I'm gonna buff over here. I don't care. I'm gonna eat some of his puny magic. I wanna hit the torch. I think he's. Oh, <laughs> that's a glass cannon if I ever seen one. He just got one shot by Great Resonance Soul. Wow. Well, oh, that's too bad, dude. Oh, God. Full Havel. Full Havel monster. Firestorm off the get. Oh, no. Roll, 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 motherfucker. Oh, my God. It's a miracle that you can actually kill these Havel fucks. Alright, let's see if I can get back over here and get my buffs off. It's coming towards me. Oh. This is not gonna let me buff. Fucking roll. Oh, oh, can I freak him out? Can I freak him out? Let's see if I can. The whole time here, I'm trying to do a guard break, but it's not fucking putting in the command. There you go. And then, how can he roll out of a guard break that quickly? What the fuck, game? You're supposed to be stunned. Well, I suppose if you have stamina left, I imagine. That might be why. Oh, that's a good trade. Fat rolling, though. He's fat rolling. Oh, he's chugging. Mistake. Big mistake. Don't don't chug, mister. Don't chug. Oh, what you gonna do now? Oh, getting those two ship damage. And bye bye. GG. Wouldn't let me buff, so I had to play rough. Uh yeah, this bill this bill relies heavily on buff with the Dark Resonant weapon. Hence why you have 30 faith and 30 inth and uh, great resonance soul. Is uh, more for punishing when they try to heal and battle or run away and shit, or uh, you can fake like uh, you can roll and then shoot prisoner soul in their face and they'll try to parry you, and then you can get in the nice damage there. Oh, he's got Havel shield, Vengral's armor, and Demon Great Hammer. Let's see if I can get a parry in here. Trying to do the guard break, but it's not working. As it, it, you put it in and it just never happens. It just happens. Oh, I got it there. Get the guard break. No, switch my dagger too slow. Roll that shit. I'll oh, still get hit. Parried, motherfucker. Bam! Oh, I love getting them Katy Perry's in. Like it, it just makes it so much better. It makes it so much better.
Alright, so we're getting summoned again by Matt, it seems. Just gonna buff up. Uh, by the way, Dex Hex build costs souls, so every time I use Great Resonance Soul and Resonant Weapon, all that costs, uh, I think it's a percentage up to I uh, have a certain amount of souls, and then it keeps costing 2,000 souls per cast. Oh, I got the guard break. Finally, the guard break mechanic worked. Oh, that felt good. I just love guard breaking people hiding behind their big shields thinking they can turtle when they don't know about the guard break mechanic in this game and they just get wrecked absolutely wrecked and that's the way it should be it was almost impossible to do that in Dark Souls 1 you just had the fisheroni backstab them do the fisheroni fishing for backstabs all day oh no be a mister that is fucking not even letting me buff when you have your buff how's that fair I guess I am a phantom and it doesn't matter if I die and all that but I still want to win to get my dragon armor Oh, I got my buff off and then you died instantly because of that damage is too good. <laughs> oh, that BM though. That BM. We got another one here. Uh, the armor I'm wearing is the Hate Knight armor if you didn't know. You can get that. This is new game. You can get it by using Bonfire Aesthetics on the uh, Crestfallen's Retreat and the Exile Holding Cells in uh, the Lost Bastille. Oh, Halbert has been the win, man. Oh, I'm trying to get that parry bait. Running attacks are so good. Running attacks are so good in this game. Alright, GG. I want to thank you all so much for watching this video, guys. Stay tuned for more Dark Souls 2. i got a bunch more PvP coming up on my channel. And I hope you enjoyed. Feel free to leave a comment, and I'll catch you next one. Peace.